Hey guys, today I'll show you how you can build your own mood light. You'll use an ESP8266 to remotely control the color of your light using your smartphone or any device that has a browser. I hope you have fun doing this project, so let's get started. For this project you'll need the following components, a breadboard, an ESP8266, an RGB LED strip, a component that reduces the voltage from 12 volts to 5 volts. You can use a voltage regulator like the LM7805 with an heatsink or a buck converter module. You'll also need 3 NPN transistors a few resistors and wire cables. You can find links for all the parts mentioned in the video description. Later, you'll also need one of these table lamps with a mood light look. I had this lamp laying around, but you can get one from a home improvement store. I got this remote controlled RGB LED strip. The package comes with a 5 meter RGB LED strip, a controller and a remote control. For this project, you'll just need the strip. You can adjust the strip size to any length that you want, by cutting it with the scissors. Before making the circuit, you have to upload the script. I'm using the ESplorer IDE. If you don't know how it works, you can find the link below this video with the code that you also need to upload. You have to change the code with your own network credentials. After uploading the script provided to your board, you'll see the ESP IP address in the serial monitor. The IP address that you want to use is the one that is highlighted. Save that number because you'll need it later in this project. To power up the circuit, I'll use a 12V transformer that also came with the RGB LED strip package. So, you will need a power jack to plug the transformer and use the 12V. I'll start by soldering the ground and the VCC cables to the power jack. Ground will be connected to the front pin and VCC to the back pin. Then, you need to assemble the circuit by following these schematics. And this is how the circuit looks like. Here's a quick demonstration of what you've accomplished so far. Open your browser and type the ESP IP address. It displays the web page where you can set the color of the RGB LED strip. This next step is optional, but for a more permanent solution, I've decided to build the exact same circuit on a strip board. I've used this buck converter to drop the voltage from 12 volts to 5 volts. This is a better alternative to the voltage regulator if you want to have your circuit turned on for long periods of time, since the voltage regulator might overheat even with an heat sink. Here's how my strip board looks like. After testing the circuit and I was sure that it was working, it was time to insert the RGB LED strip and the strip board circuit into the glass ball. I've removed the protective adhesive of the strip and curl it around a paper tube. I've placed the paper tube in the socket. In my case, it actually suits perfectly. Feel free to use any other method that works best for you. 
Then, I've connected the strip to the circuit and placed the glass ball in its place. Be careful to leave the power jack in a way that you can connect the 12 volt transformer and ultimately you can power up the circuit. This is the amazing result that you get in the end. Now you can adjust the color of your mood light with any device that has a browser. I hope you had fun building the Wi-Fi remote controlled mood light. Thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss my next projects.